Well, there's a couple of my cars here on Morris Minor. Every time I look at that, it reminds me of Mr. Cutworm, which we haven't seen for a while. And there's my old Land Rover. Um, I put a, well, rewired the plug on the back here. You can see it. Um, for the trailer I want to tow. It's been wired in before, but I rewired it. And I came back in here the next day and the battery went, it was flat, it wouldn't start. So I'm just about to do a couple of tests to hopefully to solve the problem. I've disconnected the battery and um, I'm going to do a couple of tests. First one, straightforward earth to battery terminal no light. Second test, which I have never done before but I'm going to have a go, um, I've got to go to DC amps on here, which I don't seem to have, that's a buddy nuisance. There's 10 amp there, change that over to there We'll see what happens. Well, there's nothing as far as I know connected. Um, and I've got a point O2 showing and I believe that's within acceptable limits so I wonder what's happened to the battery let's see what uh, voltage we've got in the battery Shown 1181 in that battery. We've got a second battery here that I use for the winch. That's shown 1238 and it's charged through a split charger. I know all this is this is all a bit what you Americans might call redneck, but that's how I am. Um, it all seems to function okay, although it could do with tidying up. So, I don't know what to do next. I think I might try to start it and see if it's charging. There's no spark when I connect that. So I'm going to go around and see if it'll start. If I can find some keys. So I found the keys. Um, so it's connected up. I've got a, a night diesel heater in here and the light for that is just flashing on. I think that's just a reset process it goes through, doesn't it? I don't think it means to say that it's actually drawing any, um, any current. I suppose it's worth giving it a try, see what uh,
I expect you heard that. The batteries, there's, there's not enough guts in the battery to turn it over. Um, why that should happen, I, I just don't know. So I'm going to get a, a jump lead and jump it from one battery to another. The the main charging battery here is a, is a new battery. It's not even a year old, so there shouldn't be a problem with that. Um, and the older battery, that's only well, I suspect it might be three three years. So let's stick these on. Health and safety, never heard of it. Oh. I don't know if any resting in, but worth a try. Uh, 12 volts showing there. I've got a, a new starter motor as well, which is a year old. This is it's peculiar, peculiar. Let's fix that one on there properly. is normally an excellent starter even in the middle of winter any fucking problem that Well, they're both well connected. Let's see what happens.
13.10 volts on tick over going into the battery so that's charging ok so what was the problem? I don't know
generation, generations, I should say. Sunday morning, quite early. He's left the lights on the hack up. Uh, that was my one of my favourite auto hole holes locally when we used to have opening and closing times, and that pub was full even after it closed. So 
um, is great stuff, love to be able to do it. I think this is a way, I've got this on another video as well, but uh, that is a, I believe a different type of day, you can leave this engine running. These are the South Downs and I'm having a little bit of difficulty focusing. So I'll try and do a, a panoramic view of it. Steve Munn lives down that way. Oh, is that over? No, it's over there. You want to watch it. And then, oh dear no. I can't see because of the glare. As we come round, we can see the, the, the South Downs. The South Downs, and as we come round, we're in the we're in the uh, in the Weald, the flat area between the North and the South Downs. We're coming round, still South Downs, and we come round here to the North Downs. And um, well, perhaps I'm just trying to do it too fast. Anyway, it will be what it is. We get round over this way towards Tunbridge Wells. I think that's about all I can do, my arms aching. <laughs> <laughs> 